Okay, so the fundamental question, is rape about sex or is it about power? I certainly grew, grew up at a time when people were saying it's not at all about sex, it's only about power. I've never agreed with that. If it was only about power, why is forced sex a component of it? So I, I can't agree with that. There are certainly cases where it's used as a, a way of subduing a population of women and, and, and of the men who love them, which would be a power use of it. I think within college sexual assault, I would say, and this is controversial, it's just about everything anyone ever says about college sexual assault is controversial, many of these events are enmeshed within um, contact between young men and young women that is essentially a sexual kind of contact and is a, a context in which both parties seem to be seeking some kind of a what they both at the moment assume to be a consensual sexual moment. So I think there are events that are uh, forced rapes, stranger rapes, um, intentionally power against women rapes, and I think there are events that, and this is a really controversial phrase to use, fall, I'm not going to say a gray area, I, I instantly hear the controversy around that, but there are events that people of good faith and good reason can look at the facts on the ground and say, I can't come right out and say that this wasn't in some way an assault, and I can't come right out and say that it was. And I think in those cases it's because there is some kind of intimate physical contact between men and women that either because of alcohol, because of lack of communication, um, did not end up being the consensual event that maybe either or both parties in the moment thought it was going to be. Um, but that, you know, in the moment was not about forcing power on young women. I don't think so. But you're going to get a different opinion from everyone you ask.